All right, we are back with another prize picks video. This one's going to be talking NBA specific. Um, so we're going to go over the two games that we got tonight, and I'm going to give you guys four picks on those games. Um, if you're looking for more content, though, I did just drop a Thursday night football video, and I gave you guys six picks over there. So you will ultimately have 10 picks uh, to choose from from me today uh, for free on YouTube. So go check that video out. Mix and match those picks with these picks, and uh, obviously your own intuition as well to kind of make uh, the ultimate slip for you tonight. Um, but before we jump into the board, I did just want to say, like, thank you guys so much for the support so far. Uh, we've been on YouTube for just over a month now, and we're already up over 1,400 subscribers. Um, we've been doing daily content like this, so if that's something you guys, uh, if you're watching this and you're not subscribed, uh, we've been ripping out videos like this, usually multiple videos a day, um, on games where we have, you know, Thursday of football, uh, NBA happening now, um, just so many sports happening. So just going to continue this grind, uh, but if you want to join the family, Definitely hit the subscribe button. Leave the video a like so more people can see it. And uh, yeah, I can't thank you guys enough for this growth so far. But let's jump into what we picked last time, and then we'll quickly go over our video picks for today. Franz Wagner, Wem and Yama, they kind of screwed us. Um, Franz, i kicking myself over that pick because I did the points and assists. He ended up going over his points line at 17 and a half. Uh, only had two assists on the night, uh, so just didn't quite get there for us. Um, but he started off the game really hot. He looks really like poised to have a great year. Um, so happy with Franz. Personally, uh, not happy with him for our video picks, though. Victor Wamanyama, he gets this line 100% if he doesn't have foul trouble. Uh, so that one kind of sucked as well. Only ended up playing 23 minutes. Came out super hot late in the game. Um, but Wamanyama, again, another guy ready to have a great year, um, but just couldn't get us there with the, with the limited minutes and foul trouble. And then for the guys that did hit for us, Kuzma had a great game, uh, got there without the assists at all. He had zero assists. Very ISO-heavy uh, team there in Washington with him and Poole. Uh, Tyus Jones also had a great game, uh, but Kuzma, 25 points. No kind of sweat there. He started off pretty hot as well. Scotty and Cade definitely sweats. Scotty literally had a dunk with like 30 seconds left of the game that he didn't even really need to do. Um, and then Cade had, did a lot of his damage uh, later in that game too. So um, that's the video picks from last time. I also included Maxi. I just realized, and uh, he obviously plays tonight. We'll talk about Maxi a little bit. I'll give you a, a alternative line that you could go off today. Um, but let's jump into the board. Biggest news for today: there is no uh, Bradley Beal again for the Suns, and there's no Devin Booker for the Suns. Um, so two of my picks are going to specifically be going off that. I won't be giving you guys Kevin Durant points line uh, or points, rebounds, assists. I'm not going to be touching Kevin Durant in this video. I will probably be touching him in other slips I play today, but I wanted to show you guys the value of not having those two big guys. KD is going to do what KD does for sure, um, but I think there's other guys that can maybe, uh, t you know, be, a, I don't even know how to say this, uh, get advantages from Beal and Booker both being out even more so um, than, than Durant. So let's go to our first pick. We're going to go to Yusuf Nurkic. I did his fantasy score yesterday. I'm going to go back to it today. Uh, people forget that he literally snapped his leg in half uh, in 2018 or 2019. I forget the specific year. Um, but he's like pretty much back. Like he's he's on a Portland. He was on a Portland team, um, not really competing for much of anything with with uh, Dame being injured. Um, but now he just got traded for to to be on this contender and be their starting center. Uh, so he's got new life in his career. He can rip down boards with the best of them. He can go get blocks. He can protect the rim. Um, he's a huge body down there. And he knows how to score as well. People forget that. This 13 and a half lines, I think, very, very low, uh, especially with no Booker and no Beal. Um, but I'm going to go to his fantasy score. I think he has a lot to do with uh, their success tonight. Um, and if they're going to be playing well, Nurk's going to be playing well. Even if they don't, I think he gets there pretty easily. And then next up, we're going to go to Eric Gordon. 14.5 points. We're going over. He had 10 points in last game. Um, and we can actually just check. I'm pretty sure he had 10 points. Yeah, 10 points against the Warriors here, but he shot four of 16. He shot 16 shots. Um, so pretty very like uh, consistent with his preseason. He shoots a lot of shots in a hurry. Uh, these games, these preseason games, he was only averaging 15 minutes, but he was shooting like eight times a game. Um, so now with more opportunity without Booker, who had like 30 point plus points last time and a potential to, you know, shoot a little bit better than his horrible percentage last game. Um, I think he gets there pretty easily. So those are the two sons I'm going to be attacking Nurkic and Gordon. And then for the other two picks, um, I guess I'll go over Maxi now. That will be, uh, his fantasy score. I went to his points and assists last time, uh, but this is kind of another option. We talked about last video, but Maxi without Harden 
is going to be amazing. Um, Embiid will be playing this game uh, where I like his assist potential with Maxi, uh, but Maxi knows how to score even when Embiid's playing well. Uh, so with no Harden here, Maxi ready to take another step in this league. Um, he could be an all-star this year. So I think Maxi has a great first game and uh, 36.0 is, is, is very low for a guy, especially with no Harden there. So Maxi is going to be the third pick. And then the fourth pick for today, I'm not, maybe this isn't the flashiest pick in the world. I'm going to go to Christian Wood. I liked what I saw in his limited minutes uh, for his Lakers debut uh, last game. Um, and I don't know why they brought Jackson Hayes out first in that game. Christian Wood ultimately ended up getting a little bit more minutes than him. But he played 50 minutes. He was he was a plus two in those minutes. Um, obviously, he wasn't, I think he was an all-star. If he wasn't an all-star, he was a 20-plus point scorer on that Pistons team. He's a good player. They got him for cheap. Um, but I think he gets some run. Obviously, uh, LeBron and AD are going to take up most of the forward minutes there. Uh, Torian Prince is also getting the start. But with LeBron, we just got news that LeBron is only about going to play about 28 to 30 minutes per game. Um, so that just opens up a little bit more minutes for Christian Wood. And uh, I think he kind of maybe even absorbs the, Chris, the Jackson Hayes uh, minutes as well. So Christian Wood, 15 and a half points. Um, I think he can get that very, very easily. That's that's very low. So this is going to be the four video picks. Just kind of talk about it one more time. Nurkic, 31.5 fantasy score. Eric Gordon, 14.5 points. Those are both over for the Suns. Uh, obviously, injury goes into that with no Beal and Booker. Tyrese Maxey, we got no Harden, um, a guy that has uh, potential to be an all-star this year, especially if Harden finds a, a different home uh, in the next few weeks. And then Christian Wood, very, very low fantasy score. Um, this is probably maybe the quote-unquote scariest pick of the video, uh, but I think he gets a little bit more playing time today, and uh, he can do damage in a hurry, um, and he showed us that in the past years. So these are going to be the video picks. Mix and match those with your favorite picks from the Thursday Night Football. If you haven't checked out that video, I did drop it right before this. So go check that out. Show it some love. And uh, leave the video a like. Subscribe if you are new. Comment down below. That's going to do it. Hopefully make some money tonight. Peace out.